I was once investigated by Interpol after a holiday romance with a water skiing instructor. <laughs> Please, team. Where was he a water skiing instructor? Corfu. What part of your life was this? What year was it, let's say? Um, I don't really remember, but I, th I would guess at mid-twenties. The 1920s. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was young enough to go away with my parents. I was on holiday with my parents. So what was his name? Thanos. Thanos. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you why I'm already doubting that. You just happen to look around the studio and there's a fan <laughs> over there. <laughs> His name could have been Camera Os. <laughs> Audience Os. <laughs> so when did Interpol get involved? There was a burglary from a, one of the hotel rooms and some money was How much stolen. money was taken, do we know? £75,000. What? Oh, wow. £75,000? <laughs> worth. £75,000 worth of money? <laughs> £75,000, isn't it? Of jewellery. They thought that at the airport, when we were waving goodbye, he had passed me the goods. They were suggesting I was some kind of donkey. I think it's a mule, isn't it? Not oh, a donkey. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and so when, when did Interpol get involved? When you were because, back home? Be yes, I was playing a record in my uh, flat. Uh, and I left to go and get something from the shops and I heard the record coming out of a van outside my flat. Have I had a blackout? Because <laughs> I don't know what's going on now. Is it just me? <laughs> Is it just me that's not following? I think Faye means... What do you mean? I think she means that Interpol were, had bugged your flat and you heard a recording of the inside of your flat from the Interpol van. Do you I... know Thanos? <laughs> <It's> <laughs> really all over this story. <laughs> what was the song? It was a Barbra Streisand song from Yentl that didn't do very well. What was the song? Papa, can you hear me? Oh, a lovely oh, tune. Yeah, love that one. But not on Yentl. It so <laughs> is. It certainly is. That was a test. <laughs> 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 you, you hear the Barbara. How do you know that they're Interpol? So I was just paranoid. I couldn't understand it. But when my dad rang me... Yes? ..to say, I think you're being followed by Interpol... No, oh, OK. <laughs> what on earth made him think that? Because some bloke he knows tipped him off. Some bloke he knows <laughs> tipped him off about Interpol? <laughs> what line of work is your dad in? Uh, he's a businessman. Oh, he oh. sounds suspicious as a bit vague, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. yeah. The talented yeah. Mr Ripley. <laughs> <laughs> You know about Fonna. Fonna. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a real person, so it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you think he was capable of committing that kind of heinous crime? Well, I suppose I, I loved him. He was. Can you describe the moment <laughs> <laughs> when you realised you were in love with him? When um, he gave me seventy-five thousand pounds worth of jewellery. <laughs> <laughs> So what are you thinking? There is a, an essence of truth for me. Well, this. that she once went on holiday. <laughs> <laughs> I think that Faye is lying. From the start, she looked like she was riffing it, and then very quickly had the look in her eyes of someone who's out of their depth. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a lie. You say it's a lie. I you think, think it's, it's a true. lie. Yeah, you do this. Well, it's, it's a lie. It's not. You say it's a lie. All it's right. Nonsense. Faye Ripley, holiday romance, Interpol. Truth or lie? It is. True. <laughs>